Welcome to Call Us Dekho. Today we will discuss the difference between NEET All India Quota and State Quota seats. There are many terminology that are specific to a certain exam. Doing well in the exam would be a difficult task without completely understanding these terms. So if you keep hearing about NEET 15% and 85% quota seats but don't know what it means, then this video is for you. Keep watching this video and make your counseling process easier. First, let's find out what the NEET All India and State Quota is. NEET seat allocation is done based on two types of quotas or reservation. All India Quota or AIQ means that 15% of the total MBBS and BDS course seats at different colleges across the country are filled through the NEET AIQ counseling. The State Quota, on the other hand, means that 85% of the course seats at different state colleges are filled through the NEET state counseling. Now that we have an idea of what these two quotas are, let's understand them in detail. The AIQ counseling is conducted by the Medical Council Committee. All the Indian nationals, overseas citizens of India, NRIs and persons of Indian origin are eligible for AIQ seats. Be it a private or government institution, these candidates can apply for any college in the country under the All India Quota. In other words, it is compulsory for all medical or dental colleges in India to reserve 15% of their total seats for the AIQ counseling. The states that are not eligible for AIQ are Jammu and Kashmir, Telangana, and Andhra Pradesh as they individually opted out. So if candidates from these states want to participate in the AIQ counselling, they have to furnish a self-declaration form. The All India Quota is further divided into different reservation categories. You can see the details on your screens. The state quota seats are filled through state-level counselling. Each state has its own authority that conducts the counselling process. Basically, every government college in a state must fill 85% of its medical seats under the state quota. Only the natives of that particular state are eligible to participate in this counselling. The counselling laws and norms are specified by each conducting authority. To participate, candidates must register through the official websites of the conducting authorities. Hope you found this video informative. To know more on need counselling and reservation policy, Stay tuned with Callers They Co. Good luck. If you like this video, do like, share, comment, and subscribe to our YouTube channel.